and again we get a car in the auction that represents to my mind incredible value for money this is guys is it two and a half to three and a half thousand pounds currently in our seven day online live auction that finishes on sunday it's uh, 1990 it's the xj6 with a 2.9 engine and it's got all the toys on it's got the original factory fitted jaguar radio and cassette it's got a trip computer electric windows and mirrors everything works um it's the original spec interior finishing oatmeal with really nice wooden veneer trim uh, hro in dealer badge and plates it's got 22 main dealer and jack specialist stamps in the service book it's even still got the correct period alloys and they're in pretty good shape as well engine recommissioning took place in march 21 cost about 600 quid it's still got the original toolkit car jack spare wheel it's pretty much as good as it gets it's got the original book pack um collection of previous mot certificates and invoices so like I say i think for two and a half to three and a half thousand pounds this is an incredible amount of car an incredible luxurious car to own and a pretty easy car to maintain so i'm going to take it up the road i'm going to take elliot out with me um because this is a little bit before his time um, and see what he thinks right step one l get, get your seat Adjust it. Comfy. Yep. Right, someone's had a little. Someone's had a sleep in there. Four she winks in this. Yeah, there we go. Um, right, so I've mentioned this briefly. It's 1991 Jag. It's yep. 2.9 XJ6. Guys, is it two and a half to three and a half thousand pounds? Mm -hmm. Currently in the online auction yep. um, that ends on Sunday. I think this is a huge amount of car for the money. Yeah, I think definitely. It would be a wonderful car to own and drive. I'd happily have it as a as a daily driver mm -hmm. as well as a really nice second car. So it's quite a late one. So it's got all sorts of bushels and bells on. It's got onboard computer. Um, it's got a cassette player, oh. a lot of people have converted these to CDs, if you wish. Um, and crucially with this, everything electric actually works yeah. that I have tried so far. So hopefully it's going to go on the button, as it Talk. has done every time so far. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Okay, so what we do look out for on these as well is uh, dashboard like a Christmas tree yes. with every possible warning it's light on. Quite dark. This has gotten on. They do all come on to start with, so we know that we know that they're working. It's not mm. an issue with the with the computer or the bulbs. So we have got everything on. I suspect the fuel lights going to come on shortly, but not just not just yet. Um, so we've got automatic gearbox. Um, I'm hoping it's going to be super smooth, which will just be kind of icing on the cake. Um, have you driven one of these before? No. Right, I'll drive there. You drive back. We'll just whip up the road and see what you think. But they are a really, um, they're really easy car to drive. Mm. Um, but it's a you know essentially it's just going to be a three liter engine, so there's plenty of plenty of pull. Um, right, so the wood's in, wood's in pretty good shape. Yeah. Nothing peeling, nothing coming away. Dash is good, no cracks. Door cards are good. Steering wheel's good. I mean, it's just, it's a really nice, really nice place to be. It really is, Really yeah. nice car to drive. Yeah, definitely. And what, what else can you get? Right, you, your, your kind of car, your kind of era, two and a half to three and a half grand, what, what, what are you into? For me, well, you're into an old Golf or... Are you into a really old golf? Yeah, oh yeah, no, you're, you're into <laughs> an, an, an early 2000s golf or a layer on like mine or, or whatever like that. It's, it's nothing like uh, anything as luxurious as this might be. No, it's nothing that, well, to be fair, it's like it's horses for courses, but to my mind, to get something like this for three grand ish is incredible value for money. Oh yeah. It's been serviced every 10,000 miles all the way through its life. No expense spared. Yeah, it makes Anything a difference. that's needed doing has been done and that's been completely regardless of cost. So we'll um, swap over in a minute and see what you think. Yeah. I think uh, normally for this sort of money, I would expect something like I said, dashboard lit up like a Christmas tree. Oh yeah. Uh, clunky problematic gearbox. A poor example. Yeah, spongy brakes. Loads of playback through the steering and this is just Super fine. No yeah, bottles, no. no bumps, no whistles, nothing. It's right. very nice. It's lovely blue. It's got oatmeal cloth. Everyone associates these with leather interiors. Back in the day, cloth, cloth was, was the, the cloth way was to go. The, cloth was the expensive extra. Um, so it's had some recent sort of like recommissioning work. Um, it's had new silt, engine service, throttle bodies cleaned, expensive electrical rewire overhaul, which probably accounts for. The fact that we're not lit up like a Christmas tree because yeah. everything is working as it should be. Um, it's, it's running well, I say. No knocks, no bangs, no rattles, no squeaks. No. Um, I would happily set off on a long journey in this. I think it's a, I think it's a, a wonderful car to drive for the money. As dailies go, it's cheap and it, you know, it's like I say, it's, it's not got any lights on, you're not going to have any issues. It's a, it's a comfier smoker than you'll find for anything around this price it point. It is a smoker, that is a great way to describe this car. 
So it's in the online option at the moment, www.mammapartclassics.com. Um, as I say, it's guided for two and a half to three and a half thousand pounds. It finishes on Sunday, the 6th of February. Um, all the details are on the website, photos, videos, uh, full description, etc. Uh, it is available for viewing in Royal Corner and Cheshire. It's at our premises at the moment, so please do get in touch if you'd like to come along and have a proper look at the car. Yep. Um, pictures of it on the ramp are also on yep, the website. Yeah, pictures on the ramp. Proper look underneath as well. Obviously, MOT history is all online um, from 2004 as well. But if you've got any questions, you need information, just give us a call, we'll get in touch. So, Al, would you have it as a daily? Yes. Would you have it as a second car? I'd probably rather daily it. Would you really? For the money that you're going to buy it for, why wouldn't you? Yeah, and it's 2.9, it's not going to drink petrol, it's not going to be no. a service as most people think, and you're going to be able to service it for a reasonable amount of money. Exactly. Right, so register your speed then. <laughs>